Hello everyone, uh, we have something a little special today. This is a game you have likely never heard of before. Uh, this is Tamer Island, and it is the first game I ever made. And I'm also here. Yeah, Aaron's here as well. It's the panda, orange panda. <laughs> this game has not aged that well. It's, a, it's about two years old, and I don't really like it as much as I used to, but it, it, it was a good learning experience. And I, I, I want to show it off to anyone who might be interested in trying this out. Guess what that is? Is that a boat? That's a boat. <laughs> oh, I think I see it. Relay Island. So this is that island you talk so much about. Yes, it's a place for trainers like myself to test our skills. Our strength? <laughs> you wrote the game! I wrote the game. Oh, <laughs> you look excited, but of course I am. Dropfly and I have been training for ages for oh, this. Oh, that's right. You have weird names for all your characters. Yeah, Dropfly. It is an actual fly. What is that thing in the background? <laughs> it's 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 a butterfly. I, I have heard him talk about this game a lot because I live with him. Yeah. He is my brother. <laughs> but I don't know what's going on. You don't know any of this. Thanks for letting me borrow the slab, by the way. That's the name of the ship. The slab? The slab. I don't know how it would have gotten to the island otherwise. Hey, Eugene, no problem. I've always wanted to see this place for myself. They park their boat on the side of Relay Island and go ashore. No, they parked the slab. The slab. <laughs> the, Horace, do you mind staying here for a minute? I would like to go see if people here will mind if we dock here. Of course. So I like how I went from Doki Doki Lit Club to, to this. whatever this okay. is. <laughs> You've never seen this game before. I have not. So I'm guessing you did not make these sprites? No. A challenge I want to give myself here, um, this is by technicality an asset flip, but... I wanted to make all of the... I wanted to make the game entirely with default assets as a personal challenge. Uh, this is... This is a dock, but I repurposed it as a boat, Good because job. of course I did. I like uh, the random mountain. The, you can go in that mountain. Oh, uh, heck yeah, are we gonna go right now? The, no, no, I wanna get the, the... I wanna get the first two party members first. Uh, we have Eugene, he has nothing on him. That is not a good shade of green. Why did I pick this? Because you like green? <laughs> Search for the worst green, am I right? <laughs> it's... Am I oh, right, fellow Oh, look at these bare menus. Look at this. It's such an old man. It's... Like, look at all them sprites. Hey, Eugene is awesome, all right? <laughs> I don't know. I've never played it. I have nothing to all compare right. it to. So we have uh, our first town. I think this is called... Um... Oh, I forgot the name of the town, actually. They all have names, but only like one of them ever gets name dropped in the game. Oh, good job. <laughs> you have to read up on the deep lore. I light this fire every night. Actually, oh. funny you mention deep lore. Oh, God. I'll talk about something I'm working on later. You're new here. Great NPC dialogue. I'll buy a black potion for 250 gold. By the way, this, the music, I'm not sure how many of you guys can actually hear it right now. It might be too loud, but all of the music is for, are from Genesis games that I like. Hmm. I like the random tombstone. Was that supposed to be something? Is there this? No. Wait, can you read this? No, you can't. I wouldn't have been surprised if I put something there. Um, what we got there was a uh, was a fast ring. The rings are actually something I want to use in a lot of the games I make. Um, there is one of a kind of each ring in the game, and all of them do different effects. Oops. This Good. one increases your speed by three points. And I think Eugene is... Yeah, Eugene is slow, so let's give this to him for now. All right. All right. So, uh, oh. Hey, who are you? Oh, character sprite. We know it's. Oh god, what happened? Oh god. <laughs> it's the first. It's the first fight of the game. Super plant. Super plant. All right. So, uh, <laughs> do we have any character for drop fly? Because I noticed that uh, drop nope. fly didn't have a character sprite. There is no character sprite for drop fly. <laughs> Does drop fly do anything? Uh, drop fly is like your healer. She's like a. She's like a butterfly. She also has a skill called water block. Actually, let me show it off. Yeah, we're doing this, um... Slide a block of water into an enemy. You never know which one, though. It hits at random. Good job. <laughs> Party was victorious. <laughs> what just happened? Those monsters just showed up. I don't know where they what they wanted. Please, let me heal you. He's the bad guy. I couldn't have made him go one sprite left. Uh, thank you, but who are you? He's the I'm, bad guy. I'm Cole. How can I help? He's not the bad guy. Those plants came out of nowhere. Well, I Gosh, was wondering I if, if I may dock our slab <laughs> along the shore. We're here for the tournament, after all. Wait, what tournament? tournament? I don't know about a tournament here, and I'm the head of this ma of this island. But that's impossible. It's the biggest tamer event of the season. Nothing is capitalized. Isn't tamer? <laughs> Oh, wait, okay. <laughs> what do you- did you say Tamer? Yes, I'm a Tamer, and I would like okay. to enter this tournament. I thought it was Tamer Island, or Tamer Island? What? Tamer Island. Sure, because- Tamers- Tamers are people who can tame monsters. 
And uh, that will come into play in a minute. Okay. All right, I think I know what's going on here. What? I'm sorry to have to break it to you, but I think I, you're in the wrong island. Where is this tournament? God, Relay it, Island. Eugene. You're gonna love this. This is Consequence Island. Relay Island's a bit north of here. Adam, sorry. Did you just open up a dictionary to like a <laughs> random word? Put your finger down. I'm like, I I'm think using so, this. actually. <laughs> Sorry, I should probably get going then. Thank you for your help. Now, wait a second. Could you help me out with something else first? No! What? <laughs> you see that guy over there? You're a tamer, right? How about you try and tame him? Well, I could try. I haven't tamed a monster in a while, though. I'll help. I used to be a tamer myself. Then why'd you ask what a tamer was? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't think that through. <laughs> What do I do? It doesn't look like he wants to fight. Just ask him if he wants to join you. He'll see. I'll, he's seen you defeat his buddy, so he knows you're strong. All right, Super Plant, shall we team up? The Super Plant joined your team. So just it, it, it joined you out of fear. It's afraid. <laughs> it's usually not that easy, but pretty much you need to please a monster in order to tame it. All right, thank you for your help. So the gimmick of this game is that you have, there are 17 monsters to tame. So the gimmick of this game is that it's Eternal Eyes. Uh, there's a bit more to it than Eternal Eyes. Uh, so we got the Super Plant, who's basically just like a big plant monster. Actually, the plant monster is super slow. Let's give that fast ring to him. I'm min-maxing this game but way more than I probably... where are you gonna put the ring? I'm be putting where? it on him. Where? Every, every character can equip four rings. You know, but he has no fingers. Yeah, there's one skill called Critical Crush. Adam, he's a plant. He okay. doesn't have fingers. Okay. Neither does the butterfly. How you doing? Horace, I thought I told you to stay on the slab. I got bored. Besides, I wanted to see some more of this place myself. It looks pretty barren given what's going on. Stay Actually, on I think dock. we may be gone. We may have gone to the wrong place. There's a gentleman in this building who told me that this is a different island entirely. Wait, really? Yes, yeah, so I think at, at, at one point we may have gone off course. Jeez, man, I'm sorry. No big deal, we'll just head back to the slab and sail north. Jeez. Well, if I... <laughs> I like Horus a lot, actually. <laughs> well, if it's out, if, it, if that's all that... If that's all, then fine. I'll meet you back at the slab. By the way, this game has a bunch of typos in it. I heard you talking about that, like, a few years ago. Sorry, like... again. Yeah, RPG Maker doesn't have a built-in, um spell checker because you know it was made for both english and japanese audiences and all of these games have hundreds of like pro uh, proper nouns in them yeah by the way you can also get a new uh, a new party member now oh it's a koku is it gonna kill you no catch me again i dare you this is not how it's supposed to work but aaron what this is a major character in the sequel that i'm working on oh a chicken this chicken you this... were talking about that chicken his like... name is swift that's right you, were you have to catch him <laughs> If you can get him in a corner, you can actually... No! no! <laughs> if you can get him in a corner, you can... No. Don't save your game. But don't you want to catch the chicken? I want oh, to catch the he chicken. he is so fast. That's it. I give in. The swift chicken joined your team. Alright. The swift chicken is the fastest party member in the game. Where is he, though? He hasn't appeared in your... Actually, you can only have two party members at once. Oh, fuck. The big man defeated. Liar. The I big man? I don't know what that's about, actually. I think I forgot what that's about. <laughs> Will we ever defeat the big man? I don't know. Is that a sequel bait? Are you going to put him in the sequel? So, if you go to swap, at any checkpoint, you can uh, basically swap out your party anytime you wish. I'm going to drop out, uh, I'm going to swap out Dropfly because I don't really think she's that good after the first area. You're the one who designed it. I know I'm the one who designed it, all right? <laughs> Welcome, examine anything you would like. Oh, you can buy, um, whip, sword, or bear. Actually, <laughs> I, actually, there is a, there, that is social commentary. We will get to that. Wait, oh, is that a monster behind you? That was not capitalized. Yes, it is. I'm a tamer. Sorry, then. You might get some, uh, more help next door than here. It's quite all right. I'm just looking around, though, uh, for now. But yes, uh... But yes, tamers my age usually don't use commercial weapons. Our companions do most of our fighting for us. Yeah, uh, yeah, I never get too much business from tamers. Well, have a nice day. Oh, wait. Huh? Okay, actually, I may have something that you I could sell you today. Is this why, a social commentary? Why don't you come over here? We'll get to that in a minute. All that, right. That four-year-old social commentary? Could you look at this? What is it? I don't know. My supplier dropped it off the day and, and told me that it's some sort of magic-related item. I told her that I don't know the first thing about magic, but she insisted I try to sell it anyway. Looking at it again, I think I may be able to tell you what it is. Really? What? It's a firestone, and it's used to create abilities us tamers can use. That's neat. Well, while I still don't know the first thing know the first thing about magic, I was told to sell it. Well, would you like it? Sure. How much? Does 400 sound fair? That sounds fine, though I may not have the kind of money right now. That's fine. I can hold on to it for you. Just examine it when you would like. I put way too much effort into that cutscene. <laughs> we only have 300 gold right now. 
Where's this? Okay, we're we getting that social commentary. <laughs> There's a sword here, not the kind of equipment I'd, I'd use. There's a whip here, not the kind of equipment I'm used to. There's a toy bear here, not the kind of equipment I'm used to. Wait a second, I've never seen someone use uh, one of these as a weapon before. I wonder how one would fight with this. By laws of average, there's probably someone out there right now def uh, defeating a great beast of one of these. Weapons can get pretty strange nowadays, after all. That, that social that's commentary. That's social commentary. Is that like a nuclear <laughs> warfare, am I right? Actually, actually, that's more a joke on how some RPGs think of some really weird weapons. In fact, I can actually think of one RPG where a character uses a stuffed animal. Bebedora? Right? Yeah, Bebedora. <laughs> I, you know, if if there was a bunny sprite, I probably would have used it there. And did that. <laughs> Are you going to do the same thing with the next scene where you have to use all these sprites, have the slab again? I think so. Actually, okay, I was going to talk about this later. I'm actually working on a sequel to this right now. I, that's actually one of the reasons why I thought it'd be kind of fun to let's play this. <laughs> to um, get you to buy the next game. Uh, it might... I don't know. <laughs> By the next game. <laughs> so here we can get um, rings. Now all of these rings are one of a kind. They're not that... Some, most of them are not that expensive. Uh, the hero ring is by far the best one, though. Let's see. That's the magic ring. We don't really need that right now. You're getting all them in-depth tips. Yeah, th this is a... This is... This is a... I, I think I'm going to make this a 100% run. Because might as well. Because you made it. Yeah. <laughs> this is your I game. hope I can 100% it. <laughs> Um, who has the least amount of stuff? Swift has really bad defense, so I'm just gonna give these to him. Well, he's a fast chicken. He's a chicken. He's the fastest character in the game. Is he the fastest character in the game? I know um, the he highest stats that we can have is 31. I think something might be faster, but... Oh, we got a witch? Well, no, this is not a witch. Examine it. Well, what do you think she sells? Fruit? Egg breaks okay, easily. Then. 30 gold. Oh god, I, I love my purple eggs. <laughs> Apples restores that 40 That makes health. more sense. No thank you. Did you see the Corn melon? Corn restores just... 60 health. Alright, so I'm guessing you saw the melon, you thought egg, you saw the bananas. Actually, saw... actually, all of the items, or all of the healing items, are references to Light Crusader. Of course they are. Of course they are, because I have to put a reference to Light Crusader in everything I make. Break easily. This is also a reference to Light Crusader. Watch this. You break an egg, restores 20 health. Oh. <laughs> That's the only item that has, like, a special effect like that. Um, okay. Now this is where it gets kind of interesting. For a stone a gem, I can make you an ability. Shall I? Alright, go downstairs. Uh, no, first... he's a stranger. Stranger danger, Adam. First I'm gonna examine this. There are, in total, five different elements anyone should familiarize themselves with. These are earth, fire, wind, water, and unelemented. The element. The absence of element. <laughs> un unelemented is something- is a word I'm pretty proud of, actually. The first four elements may react to each other and deal either double damage or half damage to each other depending on their matchup. Earth defeats wind, wind defeats water, water defeats fire, fire defeats earth. Unelemented has no weakness yet no resistance either. Why would fire defeat earth? Hmm? Why would fire defeat earth? Because earth is made up of like, because like all the earth guys are like plants and trees. Oh, I thought game. you were like uh, avatar stuff. No. Like, <laughs> oh, it's, it's ground. There's something hidden between the pages. It's a blast gem. That's a freebie for all newcomers of the shop. Remember to drop by every heck shop you see and read their tomes for elemental wisdom. Alright, I go down to the strange man's basement. Oh yeah, this is a cult. He's gonna sacrifice you. <laughs> so, this is when the game gets kind of cool. Or this is one, this is a, this is um the system I'm probably the most proud of in this game. Welcome to the Hex Shop. Here you can exchange your rarest gemstones for f for different types of magic. There are five stones which dictate um, which element the skill will have, and five gems which dictate which uh, kind of element the skill will yield. Walk through the chest with the corresponding gemstone and claim your skill. So on our person right now, this might take a minute to explain. We have a magic stone and a blast gem. There are five stones in the game, uh, each one corresponding with an element, and there are five types of gems in the game. Um, each one corresponding with like a different effect, a gem used to make targeting abilities. So some gems might uh, might make it so um, so um, they might give you like curative abilities. Some might sweep the whole field. So what you're supposed to do with these gems is you come over to a chest, a chest of a magic seal with, uh, ma with magic seal within. You could probably open it with a couple of rare gemstones. There's a socket near the bottom the chest for a magic stone and a crashing gem. You don't have both of these. Oh, okay. Thanks for telling me. This one um, is for the uh, the magic stone, the blast gem. Insert them. You learned bullet stone. 
Now this is how you learn magic in this game. There are a finite amount of ge uh, gems and stones in the game, and um, you can get, there are five skills for every single element. And you can get them in any order you want as long as you have the right gems. And I think this is where the game really um, picks up in terms of uh, how your type of versatility. So yeah, th th that's a system I'm actually pretty proud of. I don't think this game aged that well, but I'm actually pretty happy with how this turned out. And you're using it again for the sequel. Yep. Actually, no, I'm, I'm trying a different magic system for the sequel. Okay, I guess your good magic system's gonna go unused. A magic system inspired by Secret of Evermore. Okay, I, I, guess, I guess it wasn't unused. A strong shot similar to a cannon. Uh, I forgot how strong that skill in particular is, but, uh, we're gonna use it. There we go. All, right. All good now. So, uh, let's go to... The mountain? Yep, we're going to the mountain. I forgot the name of this mountain, but this is where we're gonna get our first random encounters. Oh, there, there we go. Yep, just flat random oh, encounters. Oh, I love him! <laughs> the Redwood Slip. I'm actually pretty happy with that name. Uh, the Redwood Slip is Fire Elemented, and uh, this thing is Earth Elemented. That's actually a weaker version of the monsters we found in that area. You can get a lot of money here if you want to just grind for the uh, the like the first few rings. Because again, hits. those are, those are finite. Yeah, I'm gonna give some like some like sweet tips and tricks for this game. <laughs> in case you wanna let's play this game yourself, am I right, guys? <laughs> Waterstone, egg, and a black potion. Heck yeah, egg. Do not drink a black potion. A vile potion often used for traps sells for sells for a lot. So black potions poison you when you drink them in battle. Um, in the sequel, they do something even worse to you. Are you gonna spoil that for uh... no, no? Okay. Status gem. By the way, you're gonna see a lot of clusters of um, of chests in this game at once because uh, I I accidentally made more skills than I knew what to do with. Like the game is only about four hours long, but it has about like twelve hours worth of skills. So sometimes you'll just see like like five or six chests just clumped together. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, it's it's kind of ridiculous. All these random encounters, am I right? You know, in my defense, they don't go they they go by pretty quickly. Like no no um random encounter in this game lasts more than a minute unless it's like a monster that's meant to be taken or unless it's a monster that's like kind of annoying by default. I'm gonna break that, I'm gonna feed a broken egg to my chicken. Oh that's that's there awful. Why would you Actually, do that? Actually, the chicken swift returns in the sequel. I should make it so he like says something if you do that. Please do, you're feeding the chicken a chicken egg. Ready to set sail to Relay Island? Or you can just say, oh, it's a duck egg, don't worry. By the way, before you go, take these two. You got the Consequence Map and Relay Map. Alright, let's set sail. With those two maps, you can return to this island whenever you want. Oh, look at this fun island. <laughs> this looks like the right island this time. Sorry again about the mix-up. <laughs> so we got um, a town, a mansion, a other hill, and a more boats. It's a rampart. More boats. It's a rampart. More boats. <laughs> You know, one thing I do love is when when games that are somewhat meant to be taken seriously have some like really subtle jokes in them. This, is, is this the joke? This one I'm actually this one I I think is pretty good. What's the password? Password? Huh? Who are you? What is this place? What what should I say? What is this place? That ain't no password I've ever heard of. Ask, <laughs> are, ask are you my enemy? He, oh, that's perfect. <laughs> hmm. So can you ever get through there? All right, time for our big we, boy house. We get we get. Uh, that was not good. <laughs> that door was not entered there properly. Oh no! Oh dear! <laughs> that mansion isn't as good as I thought. Who is this? T Tamers go through that door to the right. Uh, sorry, you're not on the list. So we have to get on a list before we can actually do a tournament. This is where the tournament is, by the way. But first, we steal their stuff. <laughs> Waterstone. And there's another party member you can get right here. Just, just a just a dragon chilling. He's you know? chilling. Do you have a black potion? Can I have one? Thanks. Hey, the green dragon are in your team. <laughs> oh, you got him. Sorry, only people with an admission ticket are allowed up here. In other words, I couldn't be asked to actually give dialogue to all of those people. <laughs> you could just have them ask all the very simple question. Are right. you my enemy? Are you my enemy? Oh, go to tree. Go to a... The, the tree is, some, is nothing. Oh, you should have made it something. Make a tree in your next game. No, I'm just... Okay, now, are you ready for one of the most random cutscenes ever? Very much. <clears throat> okay. How do I get across? How you doing? Oh, hello, I'm fine, I guess. I just have a bit of trouble getting to town. 
about that. The bridge broke a little while ago and some people were crossing it. We've been getting so many people recently um, for the recent event that the old bridge simply couldn't hold anymore. Oh my goodness, is everyone all right? Yes, they're fine. The water is still and rather shallow. Well, that's good to hear. But how am I supposed to get across now? I would like to visit your town so I can sign up for the Tamer event. Well, you can jump. Excuse me? I'm sorry, but I was asked to tell people to, ju to just jump across the landmass so that we could rebuild the bridge again. Well, I guess I could try jumping, but what happens if I fall in? That's what I'm here for. Oh, I see. Well, I guess I could try. You want to know the story behind that cutscene? I found that, that you can make RPG characters jump, and I really wanted to try it. I'm not kidding. This game is very experimental, but not really in a good way. Like, I, ju I just found features, and I'm like, I want to try that. It's like, oh, that's <laughs> cool. I got to put it in. That, that, that was kind of the mentality behind this. What a peculiar way to get into a town. And then they just float to you. At least I'm kind of self-aware about it. <laughs> The stream is really fun to play in. Don't worry, Hill. I'm grabbing you if you fall in. Oh, speaking of fall in, if you just if you step in front of it, regardless of where you are or came from, you'll just jump across by default. So be a little careful about that. I gotta get some men and fix that bridge soon. Telling that guy to ask people to jump across the river all day was a pretty silly idea, actually. Get out of my way. Does this look like a good fishing spot? I don't know. He said oh, no. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, we're gonna be trapped here forever! Oh, no. <laughs> I didn't think this through. What chaos have you wrought upon uh, us? <laughs> oh, this is a... Learn the fireball spell and I will join you. Oh, I love him. Sometimes, actually, that's the best party member in the game. I love him. He has him. a broken spell that can one-shot some bosses. He's a friend. Good luck uh, booking a night at the local inn. It's full of tamers right now. Here's another line I'm pretty happy with. What are you doing in my house? Oops, sorry. <laughs> but what, you gotta talk to the children first. You can't get to the children. That woman doesn't move. This town has always been so hectic around this time of year. There are these uh, fire monsters outside, which have given me some trouble. So I had the hex shop build me a water skill. So cool, there, there's thanks. some there's some subtle um, hinting as to. How, oh, I love this woman. There's some subtle hinting as to uh, how you're supposed to use the hex shop. What do you think she says? Um. I will beat you up. No. I'm old. <laughs> Thanks, NPC. <laughs> Go talk to that dude down there. There's this, a... this town, I think, is going. I'm going to bring back in the sequel. I should just have her say, I'm still old. <laughs> I'll buy a black potion for 500 gold. You gave it to the dragon. Oh, yeah, I did, but I don't have one. On every I incrementing island, uh, that number he'll buy him off of you increments by 250. Look at this anime boy. A monster's strength ne it never actually increases, no matter how much they fight. And that's to tell you that characters don't actually level up in this game, but I still put the level uh, the levels in there anyway. Oh god, that's infuriating. That was an oversight on my part, actually. This yard is so lovely. I'm old. I'm old. <laughs> I'm old. <laughs> still old. Locked. I'm older. Locked. The right house you can't get in. That one you get in before you leave this area. Uh, do you think it's a good stopping point? I we're, think we're it is. We're 23 minutes. Alright, next time on Tamer Island, I don't know, <laughs> but Adam time, does, hopefully. I do know, I do know. We might do the next the first boss next time. Sounds good. <laughs> See you guys then. Bye. Egg.